Yo, what is up everyone? It's with a heavy heart that today I bring you the announcement of the end to our What If Naruto Could Copy Geki Genkai series. But before we part ways with this amazing series, I want to take a moment to share with you all why this decision was made in the end. Uh, when I first started this series, I was truly excited to explore this fascinating what if scenario surrounding Naruto and his abilities, as we delved into a captivating world where Naruto possessed the ability to copy any Keke Genkai he saw, opening up practically endless possibilities for growth and development, not only in his power set, but the characters and how he interacts with characters around him. Through the series, we witnessed Naruto's journey be uh, as he honed his skills, forming bonds with his teammates and facing formidable opponents, from mastering new techniques to navigating complex missions, and each episode being filled with excitement and intrigue. However, despite my passion for the project, I've come to realize that it hasn't received the level of support and engagement that I hoped for as a creator. It's important for me to prioritize content that resonates with my audience and foster a sense of community and connection. I want to take this opportunity to express my whole heartfelt gratitude to each and every one of you who was supporting this series thus far. Uh, your views, your comments, and all of your feedback meant the world to me, and I am truly grateful for your continued support. Moving forward, I will be focusing my energy on creating content that aligns more closely with the interest of the community and fosters a deeper engagement and connection. But do not fear, the gap left in the schedule with uh, What If Naruto Could Copy Kika Genkai will soon be filled by What If Naruto Was a Senju, a community favorite in the What If Naruto space. And this specific series will have some animated aspects and even like a little animated trailer at the start to really set the scene and give you a clear vision of what the end goal to this What If is. But just as this one, I do hate... Uh, I said, hey, uh, I do really hope that you guys could give that the love and support you give some of the other series, since the more love and support I get and see, the more I will be able to engage with you guys and create a more cohesive story that will end up uh, being something all of us can agree on and enjoy together. But if the engagement is lacking similar to what it was in this series with only a few hundred views and practically no comments, there's really not much I can do to improve on my content. And if you do want to see my content improve, make sure to leave any uh, critiques, suggestions, or ideas down in the comments below. I am always glad to respond to you guys. And once again, thanks all of you for being a part of this journey with me. While this might be the end of the chapter of one series, I'm excited to embark on a whole new adventure of what ifs along with you. Until next time, take care and be awesome.